miss the speeches? Hood, I don't remember inviting you. Since when has a man needed an invitation to his own house? Oh, I don't know. Probably since he lost all rights to that house by becoming an outlaw. <laughs> I would have declined anyway. My men and I are here on business. Please, everyone, if you could assist us by removing all your jewellery and valuables and handing them to that man over there. Much? And then proceed to that room where you will all wait quietly until we've gone. Do as he says. Wise decision, Gizmo. Oh, come on! Move it! Move it! Get up there! Oh, oh, going. Going. This way, please, my friends. Thank you. Look on the bright side. No, don't be shy. You'll sleep well tonight, knowing your donations will be feeding the poor of Nottinghamshire by this time tomorrow. Plenty of room. Signal. Nearly done. Master. So, Robin, this is ugly. Yes, this is ugly. This is my house. So, Marion. Back off, Luxley. Marion does not carry money about her person. How do you know? He is right. I do not carry money. My compliments. You are very wise to take precautions when there are so many unsavoury characters around. But this ring. Robin, signal. Leave that. Robin. The signal! Let's go. We should do this again. What are you doing? You're a killer now. When I have to be. Grow up. Gisborne made his choice. Everything is a choice. Everything we do. You told me that. What choice? In the Holy Land, Saracens came to kill the king. But it wasn't Saracens. It was him. Rubbish. He stabbed me and left me for dead. And then he went to kill the king in his bed. I don't believe you. This is about Not. you and me. I want you to know I didn't realize he was going to announce the marriage. Well, you didn't seem uncomfortable. I have proof. His arm, I wounded him, his tattoo. What tattoo? And I was uncomfortable. He has a tattoo on his arm. You took his ring. You took his ring? And how could he have been in the Holy Land? He was here in your house. What? He was unwell for many weeks. No one was allowed to see him. That is why I have to kill him. No, even if you are right. I am right. A trial, the process of law. There is no law. Until Richard returns, the sheriff is the law. Gisborne is the law. And that is why I have to kill him. No, I forbid you. You don't believe me? I don't know what to believe. Guy... He's not a man who would... Surely. Of course. He is to be your husband. Well, you know full well I agreed to that under duress. You know I have to play things this way from the inside. For my father, if for nothing else. I do not have the option to just run off into the forest. What? Everything... is a choice. 